everybody. In the middle of an intense song here, though. How's it going? Welcome to the Monday stream. Back on YouTube for Minecraft twice in a row. What is going on? It's all good stuff. Just thought there's more viewers over here than there was on Twitch. Even though I prefer Twitch as a platform, uh, you know, I really like uh, I really like having viewers. So we're going where the viewers are. So we're coming over to YouTube today for I don't know. We'll go back to Twitch eventually. It'll happen eventually. Or tonight we're doing some Minecraft Dungeons, Dragons, and Space Shuttles. Uh, I have the... We learned our lesson from last time. I now have the uh, low latency mode on on YouTube. So there should be like less than a uh, like 45 second delay. as was last time here. Or more. But this time around, it should be much better. Here, let's get this switched over. Beautiful. It is not switching over though. Hold on. Should have set this up first and tested it, and now it works. Oh, it doesn't work at all. Well, that's going on here. Um, I can fix this, guys. Hold on a minute. There we go. Perfect. Now let's get some chill music on. So I did a lot off camera. It's been since Wednesday last week. Feels like forever. Nope, there's a lot of guys under there. All right, so. Loading in here. Super chill. Um, we... First of all, I'm gonna test this out and see what our frame rates are doing here now. I upped my CPU a bit. So we might have a much better stream than usual too as far as frame rates go. Which will be fantastic. Um, let's see. What, where did I want to start here? Let's start... So I did a lot of food making off camera here. I got a lot of... I'm trying to get all of the, the fruits and vegetables taken care of here. So I don't have to worry about that stuff anymore. Um, I'm up to six hearts now. What are we at for our next heart, though? I'm curious about that. Food book says 317 out of 350. So a ways to go. That said, I do have what? I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one foods ready to go here. Am I gonna do face cams tonight or not? I'm not sure. I shaved my beard off, guys. And I know that's gonna even tempt you even more. Some of you on Discord have seen it. I don't know. I have a friend in my, my base somehow. Oh god, I'm glad that works. The lunchbox is also- yeah, also the lunchbox is full of things. I just counted all those things. There's- what did I say? 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27 things in here. So, we are good to go on foods. I'll load this back up again with the new stuff here. We'll have- we'll have our way close to a new one very, very soon here. Is there another guy around here? Feral Flare Lantern? What is... What is that? I don't know why guys are coming in the house, though. This normally doesn't happen. I think it's, like, well lit in here. I don't know. I'm getting, like, Enderman coming in here. Taking my taking my flooring. My beautiful shag carpeting. Uh, look at this guy up here. What are you doing? to kill the mom and the children. What is that door open for? Is that the problem? I left the door open? Oh, they just busted it down. Never mind. It's not my fault. This is, this used to have the hydrogen, fried hydrangeas in there. And uh, there's no more. So I think the problem is they don't have a door anymore. That's the big issue. Uh, let's see. What are we feeling like for a door? Dark oak today? I don't, I wasn't playing that much. I don't know why I'd be missing a door. Here, we got three more though. So what has happened since last time? Feral Flare Lantern. Let's take a look here. Oh, birch door. I should have done a birch door. I don't actually don't have, I don't have a lot of lanterns. That's how you spell it. 
lantern. Ah, right here. Feral flare lantern slowly illuminates a large area. Removing the lantern causes lights to slow to decay. Um, not that bad. Mana glass I don't have. Block of luminescence might be tough to come by right now. Uh, luminescence is... Actually, that's not that bad. That's not bad at all. But I, I think I don't think it keeps mobs away, though. It seems like it just lights up the area. I was hoping it was something some like that, uh... That one torch from, uh, Reliquary. That, like, literally, like, repels mobs. Mana pool glass. That shouldn't be tough to come by. It's just, like, it doesn't, like, provide anything I don't have already. I don't think... See, I have this thing on. This Illuminator here has the... Uh, Illuminati trait and I believe that trait is what lights up all these all the little like lighting spots you'll see around this provides those so it has uh let's see whenever oh it's, it's the glowing one whenever your tool gets too dark sacrifice this part of itself to light up your way so the illuminator here is um lighting up the area as we walk around all these little spots here it automatically is lighting up the area for me so I don't have to worry about too much and it also lights up, uh, the Illuminati, uh, lights up things for me. So I can see through walls. And I can fire through walls, too, which is nice. I also made the Silver Crossbow off camera. It was part of a quest. I guess I should look through the quest today and see what's going on there. Um, let's charge this guy up, too. So ready to go. I'm really loving the laser, guys. It's been so nice having that. It can two-shot enemies for the most part. One-shot a lot of them. Uh, and there's still, I think there's still modifiers left on it now. I think I have more room. It has three modifiers still. And I'm up to sharpest. I don't think I can do any more sharpness on it. We'll find out. Oh, I can. Holy cow. Uh, I can add on the sharpest test. It's up to 15. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Let's get this bad boy into like a one-shot weapon. For the most part. Because that makes the battery last longer. Makes everybody happy. I need eight more. I want to take the next modifier. The, um... The modifiers I'm getting as we level this thing up, so... We'll get more even. We can add on like looting or something like that next. There's an Astros block that lights up the room also. Oh, I got that on me still. Uh, let's see. Galactic Phaser. That's this basically what this thing is. It's this zippy zapping things everywhere. Uh, I got all this solidified experience here too. So I was working on, let's see where we're at here. So I have quests to turn in there. Let's go to the kitchen workshop here still. What I got done here. I got the blenders done. We'll claim those guys. I got the diamond juicer and the uh, iron juicer done. They weren't too bad. We got the sugar done. That was really easy, obviously. I can get, I don't know, honey drop, I guess. We can't really get that naturally right now. I made those crispy puffs. You probably saw those. Got that done. I got the caramel apples done, because it's in the season here right now. I got the dough done. That was one's already completed from long ago. I got pie plates done. I don't remember doing this, but I did get it done, apparently. And we can make pies now with that. I haven't done it yet, but we can do it. Uh, this we did long, long ago. This uh, olive crushing tub for olives and stuff. Uh, I got raw bread completed. We still got the, like, the baguette quest line, apple pies, blueberry pies. That's not too bad. Um... And I have bell peppers done. We are on to zucchini now, which I actually don't have very many of. So I got the seed for it at least. We have some planted. It's just going to take some time. Um, get that one done. Fidel's O'Brien is done. We get caramel fudge. Uncle Caramel Fudge is a new one. After that, we're on to celery, which I have some of already. Spinach we got done now. And we're on to corn now. And beef wellington is the next thing. Corn we have planted already. I got nine of those planted. We'll have to come up. That'll be coming up. No problem here soon. And uh, vinegar is actually a tough one. I think vinegar. We needed the fluid transposer, and I haven't made that yet.
Flu Transposer needs steel. That's why I haven't made it yet. So I don't want to burn my steel on it just yet. Probably wouldn't hurt to make that, though. And then once I get this, I can take the Flu Transposer and throw the... Uh, the vinegar into bottles. Is there crop sticks and stuff? Not in this one. There's no crop sticks. Uh, there's just uh, mystical agriculture, which is kind of fun. But uh, yeah, nothing that like the, that old agriculture uh, mod that added those. I don't believe so anyways. I know Rustic has something that does that, but the Rustic stuff isn't any different than the Pam stuff. So there's, for the food anyways. So there's no point to doing that. Uh, my pack is full here of stuff. So we got food, oh, veggie strips I dropped over there. We'll pick those up in a second here. Let me drop off the foods I haven't eaten yet into here so that we can add those to the list of things to do today. Thankful dinner. Nice. Uh, rice cakes I've eaten. We'll drop off our uh, coins as well here. That'll free up some space. All right. And veggie strips I haven't eaten yet. So that's another heart then for sure today. If we eat all this stuff. If I just pig out on things. And I keep refilling this. Let's get some of these rewards. Nothing good. Nothing good. Nothing good. Just pretty typical for these reward crates in this thing. Eh, it's not too bad. The pyrothium is tough to come by at the moment. So I don't mind that. We have a little bit already though. Uh, we're at the stuff here. Right, this here. I'm in the process. Redstonia crystal block. Got one another one of those. Honey drop, I guess I can use for uh food crafting. Can you can upgrade the loot bags? I didn't know that. Well, that's good to know. If I like craft them together or something. Cause that would be cool. Let's just throw this stuff in here for now. We'll sort it out later. Okay. So anything in here? Go good. Okay. And then we have ground cinnamon. Drop that off. Also, what happened to my gun? What's right here? Is your gun goes there? There's blocks for it. Okay. All right. I'll look into that. Dropping off one of these. It's ground cinnamon. Go over here. All right, we're sorted out then. Uh, today, what the heck? There we go. So going through the quest still here, we have that's taken care of. So that's the kitchen done. Uh, we did a little bit of mining off camera here. I got the diamonds done because we already had that done already. Uh, platinum chest plate, I guess, is okay, but I already have that fire aspect or two diamond hand saws. I don't need more hand saws. I'm just going to wait on that, accepting that one. Because I don't know if I don't really need anything out of there. Uh, the ruby's done. Silicon blocks will need for crafting uh, other things here. I'll take that right away. These red alloy plates. It turns them into points for converting like EE table, but for loot bags. Oh, interesting. I'll take the plates. Actually, no, the block is better, right? Because that's eight. Eight redstone. Eight redstone blocks is a lot of redstone. That's a ton of redstone. Um, I'll definitely do that. We can make our own plates. Anything out of here? Dark glass, maybe? Bloody, infu Bloody cobblestone doesn't do anything for us. Evil infused powder. I'll have to look into that. Evil infused powder. Evil infused powder takes blood infused glowstone dust. Evil infused powder. Oh, it can be used to make dark magic. Oh, that's how you make it. You take dark magic dust and use a centrifugal se separator. What can you use this for, though? Oh. Enchanted ingots make those evil infused ingots. Ooh, yeah. That's something we wanted because that has the evil aura. I don't think that's that good. But the speed on some of this stuff is good. I believe. Take the blood out of the cobblestone. Can I, can I do that? I have some over here. I think I have a lot of it sitting around here someplace. Yeah, I got some right here. 
I just use it for crafting the spirit reanimator. Revive vengeful spirits. Revive vengeance spirits, not not vengeful. Why would I want to revive a vengeance spirit? But if this is all it's used for, then I have enough of it already. I have 13 of it. We'll hold off on this one. Dark glass is nice for building a mob farm. I don't really need that. Uh, we got dark gems done. We got... That's it then. Okay, that's it for the tier 2... Tier 1 smeltery. Tier 2 smeltery. I just got a little bit of this action done with that crossbow. You saw. Claim that. Claim this. Claim that. Claim that. Uh, we got a signal, signal and bow limb. I see two. What happened to I see two? I don't think... I don't know. I don't think they've, that's even, like, in development anymore. I'm not even sure. It's been... I think a lot of the... The IC2 stuff has been done by, uh... Was it Industrial Foregoing, maybe? This has the look of a lot of the Industrial Craft stuff. Industrial Foregoing has a lot of the same... Hooks in it, I think. Similar, anyways. It also looks like... It looks like, um... A combination, almost, of Industrial Craft and, uh... Uh... What was that called? Factory? Whatever that factory one was. That name escapes me now. Mine Factory Reloaded. That's the one. Mine Factory Reloaded. I can make the liquid crystal now. You're right about that. What were we going to do with liquid crystalline? There was something we were going to do with that. Uh, Yerdine fluid? No, that wasn't it. Liquid crystalline cells. We can make an enchanting table now. Uh, Stargate controller crystals. What else could we use with this? Carpenter. Ah, here it is. Um, not chunk loading. There's a lot of stuff. Holy cow. Oh, we were going to make, um, thermal, uh, foundation upgrades, maybe? Was that what we were doing? It's mechanism speed upgrades. It looks like all the kind of upgrades are with this, though. Efficiency upgrades for solar flux. Thumbcraft golems, yeah. Yeah, that stuff was great. Those golems are kind of fun. The upgrade kits. Uh, I did this, I did this, I did this. Did I not? I did one of these already. I don't know what we're going to do with it. Processing speed. This is a reception coil. Okay, it's processing speed up. Uh, secondary output chance. We was looking. I was looking at this one. We need glass pipes though for this one. That's right. We were looking at this. We need hard glass to make glass pipes. Pathfinding still sucks. That sounds about right. Yeah, I don't remember what we're gonna do with this. There's so many things though. It could have been. It looks like a lot of the machine upgrades though. Most of it seems to be machine upgrades. Well, I'll think of it, I'm sure. Uh, so that's it for the tier two smeltery one. Uh, we're still working on things here. Dilithium ingots, I'm still working on making those. Um, we could do the sword and katana ones. Actually, make your own katana might be fun. I gotta make the large plate cast. Yeah, let's make our own katana quick. See, I don't know if I can do anything with these ones now. I don't think the loot bags... Let's see if there's anything in this mod other than this loot bags. Uh, let's see. Bag opener. Bag recycler. This box is capable of converting items that can drop from loot bags into more loot bags. It will save its contents when broken. So this is capable of converting items that can drop from loot bags into more loot bags. 
This is bag is capable of storing most loot bags and convert most configured types. So we need some end game stuff here. Platinum plates, gold chest, Oslo glass gears for making that. Uh, it's a bit of a bit of a job. And then we gotta find majestic ingot. I have like one of these. We gotta spend it carefully. Loot recycler takes loot that could go in bags and puts it into bags. Converting items that can drop from loot bags into more loot bags. Interesting. And then the bag and opener just opens bags. All of this stuff is pretty much late, late game, it looks like. Yeah. Reinforced alloy, we can do that now. Crushed diamond, it just takes a lot. Chemistry craft can make any resource. Yep, that's true. We could do that. Once we get into that part of it. I think now that we have steel, we will get into that. It's not, yeah, it's not called chemistry. Yeah, the, whatever the chemistry one is. I know what you're talking about, though. It's the, um, I have some sitting around here. Just that one. It's, uh, I'm not going to find it now. It's down here. I have all my stuff down here. And I have lots of stuff. Alchemistry. Or there was another one here, too. There was this one, Rock Hounding Mod Chemistry. So, one of those two. The Alchemistry stuff, though, I think needs steel. Once we start getting into that. Vision Controller, yeah. We need steel and Empowered Redstone. Yeah, we don't have the Empowerer yet. Um, and that might be a little far away still. Obsidian Gear, we're not too far away from getting a refined Obsidian Gears. Harding Glass, we can make... Vision casings, barium, magnesium, barium I don't have. We have to find barium, so we have to make this chemical combiner first, which takes empowered void plates, I need the empowerer still, diamatine and vandium. Vandium we can get. The empowerer is the big problem here. I don't know if I can actually make that. The empowerer recipe is Inori Lumium, Inori Lumium. Uh, intermedium gears would be tough to come by right now. But lithium ingots are tough to come by. Tough alloys will be tough to come by. We're not like, we're like right on the cusp of being able to get this empowerer. Um, pneumatic, pneumatic craft steel. Is there a way to make uh, steel with pneumatic craft? They got like pressure stuff, right? Pneumatic craft. Uh, let's see. Tech reborn, Tinker's construct, thermal, thermal, thermal. Nuclear craft and get former. That's not what I want. Immersive engineering arc furnace. That's probably. That's probably where you go next. Or industrial blast furnace. Yeah. Industrial blast furnace might be where we end up. That's the tier two crafting table, which we'll be making soon here. We need a lot for that, obviously. Before we get that, we need the rolling machine for this one. And the rolling machine is the tier one crafting bench. So we could potentially make this soon. I just need a lot of steel plates. Oh, I need um, thermiotic fabricator for that. Thermiotic fabricator takes mana infused. That's tough to come by. But we can probably get it. This takes that. Heat conductors, lava bricks we can get. That part we can get. It's just a lot of steps for everything. It's a lot of steps for everything. That's the biggest problem. Oh, we got some mana glass right there. All right, we got some more of that. We got some more of this. Hey, is that watermelon? I've already eaten it. Nice. All right. Dragon pets are a thing. Yes, dragon pets are a thing. We haven't found any eggs yet, though. I believe we need to get one of those first. And to get that, we need to go looking for one. Oh, let's go kill some more quests here. Uh, smell three tier two. I got okay. That's parts done. We might look at that next year. In mystical agriculture off camera here, I grabbed the arrows. That was pretty easy. Uh, grab the infer inferium arrows. Probably just grab. I don't even want any of those things. Let's wait on that. And here, this is gonna be garbage. All of it's kind of garbage. Intermedium essence. That's pretty decent. We need to kill specific kinds of dragons, though. We have to find the underground dragons. And we haven't located any of them yet. 
the above ground dragons don't seem to be to the level that they can produce eggs. We need tier four and above, and we've only found tier three above ground. I think with tier four, you have to get underground four. And those are the ones that have eggs that drop. Solium dagger's done. Got a block of Inferium Essence off of that. The crafting seeds tier two done. We got all oh, this stuff's dropping on the ground now. Stuff's dropping everywhere now. Let's drop some things off quick. Too much, too much crafting. Too much, too much quest gift taking here. Once we can get like deep, like, well, I mean, we can get underground right now, but it's just like a matter of doing it. Finding the right spots. We need to go like mining like a, a winter biome probably to find a uh, ice dragon. So that we did the coal uh, seeds. I had done this previously already. We just hadn't gotten to this point where the quest actually counted. Got that done. Got this done. And we're doing this mystical essence as well. Got that part done. And then we just got to get Botania flowers now. Six light blue flowers. Shouldn't be too tough. I'm sure I actually just have that sitting around. We can we can complete that right now. Six light blue flowers. Done. And claim that right away too. Because why not? So now I'm up to tier three crafting seeds, which actually take quite a bit. We need to get mana. We need to get this dilithium ingots. I'm waiting to craft this because we need to use this for a different quest. I don't want to burn through them. This Osram we haven't found yet. The Osram we can make from... We need Osram dust. We get it from the Osram ore, I believe. Osram ore and a pulverizer makes that. We need to find Osram ore. Uh, we find it in the negative one, negative one dimension. At, t at level 32. So we need to go to the nether and look for that at level 31 or 32. Which isn't outside the realm of possibilities right now. This is a little dangerous there. That's all. Uh, What's this do? What does Bloody Mary as a trait do? Um, we're going to put this where I can see what it does. If I put it on here. Does bonus damage depending on the amount of health already lost by its target. There's a chance to drop a coagulated blood from each hit. Hmm. Tinker's Obsidian put redstone and sharpening kit on obsidian parts, make it unbreakable and permanent. Obsidian, uh... The... Yes. The problem with that is we have to use the obsidian, reinforced obsidian plate. And for what I remember, that was a bit tough to come by. Yes, we needed compressed obsidian and blast brick, reinforced blast brick, which takes steel, I believe. Yeah, steel with blast brick. We don't have a lot of steel right now. So I'm waiting on that. I don't need things to be unbreakable, honestly, because they're they're pretty healable. I've made these things pretty repairable. This just use this can be repaired with bronze or up or obsidian itself, so that's not too bad. Uh, Picky here is, uh, has the botanical, botanical, uh, thing on it, and ecological. So it, it, um, replenishes itself automatically. And same with Stabby here. So these things auto-repair themselves already, and they'll get better if I add on the, uh, mossy. Um, that, that growing moss stuff. Where is it? This thing, the mending moss, if I ever get to this point... Of getting, we need Prudentium ingots. That's the thing that's stopping us there. And the Rune of Earth. That's not too bad. We can get the Inferium Coal Block. Man of Steel, 10 ingots. That part's not a problem. It's just the uh, Prudentium ingots are tough to come by at the moment. We're not too far away from that, actually, though. We probably have a couple. Yeah, we got enough. Well, that's just making one of them. I don't know what I'd actually put it on. Make the moss with barrel. I don't know what that means. 
But, uh, let's see. Oh, let's take this down so we can put it into our drawer here. Got a notch apple. Bottles of enchanting going here. Let's drop some of this other stuff off here. So I'm sort of through right now. Let's drop this off in here. We'll hang on to that guy. All right. We're taking a look at the signal and bow limb. Water barrel and cobblestone makes mossy stone combined to make moss. I don't think that is the big problem here. The moss we can make pretty easily. Stone essence and natural essence. That's very, very easy to make right now. Um, and it makes eight for that. So that's not bad at all. So the moss isn't the issue. It's just the... Uh, we also have, different, we have different, a lot of different means of making it right now. But we can even use the fluid transposer once we make that. Which should happen. It should happen very soon. Uh, I guess I'll put the Bloody Mary on this one. I mean, that doesn't really matter. I'm not going to use this thing ever. I'm probably just going to throw it in here and never use it be honest our other stuff's too good I might even get rid of the bow pretty soon here it's nice to have a backup but it is definitely is the backup dragon bone arrows and all that okay okay we're good on that uh where are we at now so that part's done Flying through a quest line, we have not gotten to this yet. So we need to get last things done is this, and then this. Those last steps. Superium Essence and Tier 3. Tier 3 will let us make that then. You can't just cast Obsidian. You can't, yeah, I mean, yeah, you can, yeah, right. You can just cast Obsidian. That part's done, that part's done, that part's done, that part's done. Oh, White Magic. We did a little bit of this. Um, we have this one done already. Oops. Uh, I'm not going to turn that one in yet, though. We have this luminous crafting table already crafted. I should just go grab it. That'll save us a little bit of crafting. And then it's that, and then the light well. And then we might be done with tier one of mystical agriculture. And then black magic, I haven't touched it at all, really. Or white wizards. Um, okay, let's go grab our ta table here. Let's, before we do that, let's sleep. And then we'll grab that. Excuse me. All right, done. It is on top of one of these hills here. Kill withers and other rare bosses for essences in other dimensions. We're ready for that yet. I have no idea how bad the weather's gonna be in this mod pack. Everything is very, very scary. I hate to see how they've uh retooled the wither for this. We haven't fought any of the vanilla bosses at all yet. Put that back. Okay. Got that part done. Grab all that. And then we are on to the light well. Light well needs to be crafted. The luminous crafting table requires a few rock crystals. Now, when you hover over the rock crystals, hold sneak, and you can see the properties of the rock crystals, such as size, purity, and cutting. And when you craft your light well, make sure you pick the crystals of the lowest purity, because we will need purity higher, higher purity crystals later. Okay, so we want to use low purity crystals and um, make a light well, which is just crafted here with ruined marble. Chiseled marble, aquamarine, and a rock crystal. So we need three of the marble and a rock crystal. Why did that drop? Did I just use that somehow? Oh, I did. Oh, that sucks. Well, I got a fun thing in front of my house now. 
Um, didn't mean to do that, though. Oh, well. Uh, pure crystals. Yes, we have some crystals in one of these chests here. So we have the... Oh, three, we need three of those. We need... Chiseled marble, two of those. We need uh, low purity ones. So 20%, 76 we should not waste. These probably are fine. This one we should hang on to. 76% purity. That we should hang on to. And then we need two of these. And that should be it. Chiseled, ruined, crystal. Oh, we actually only need three of those. We only need one of those. So I'll use my lowest quality one, which was the 20%. 20%. All right. And let's go out the back. You know what we're going to take? We're going to take Griffin. It's too slow to get around without you, buddy. We've just gotten lazy now. Oh, yeah, stay there, buddy. All right, let's see if we can actually craft this. I don't know if we'll have enough uh, starlight in this. That's not nighttime. It'll be a little bit more at nighttime. Oh, we need to tap this with our uh, wand, right? That's how crafting this works. So cool. I love this. Sweet. Light well is complete. Okay. Uh, uses on this thing. We get liquid starlight with this. We throw a uh, rock crystal into it. We might need more than one of these then, huh? Let's see what it says to do next year. Uh, we get those two things. That's fine. Uh, liquefy item. So put the light well down and under open sky. And then right click the light well with the valid item to in your hand to create liquid starlight. These items can't be removed from the light well and will continue to generate liquid starlight until they shatter. Valid items are aquamarine. Resonating gems, rock crystals, attuned rock crystals, celestial crystals, attuned crystals. Okay. So we just generate starlight with this. And we should probably put it someplace near the base because it sounds like after these shatter, we'll have to refill it. We can make a stone fluid tank to collect it, I'm guessing, too. So this is just a detection one. But I can use aquamarine because I do have a lot of that at least. Oop, forgot my, forgot my guy. Let me leave without you. All right. So we need open sky and some aquamarine. This will shatter. Probably quicker because it's a it's a more common thing, right? But the less common the things, like the rock crystals will last longer. But I don't want to break any of those. Uh, let's put this over. Let's put it here next to the house. Got a clear view of the sky. Put it right here. We'll throw in an aquamarine, and it will generate light from that starlight. I can't see how much it's generating, but I get it. Okay. I get a rotten egg. Ooh, from ice and fire. Is this the kind that spawns a, uh, a cockatrice? Should be near the altar. Oh, I can't take it back out again. I'll wait for this one to shatter and I'll grab out the liquid. I'll grab the starlight out and uh, put it over by the other one. Uh, okay. Liquid starlight bucket. Fill a bucket with liquid starlight. We'll do that as soon as we can. Uh, stone fluid tank. I probably have done this already. Light wells can hold up to two buckets worth of starlight liquid. You want a liquid container nearby to put liquid in during generation. Okay. So we'll do that. That's an easy one. Uh, I need... Just a bunch of stone and a bunch of glass. Cook stone, looks like. This should work. And glass... Got that, and I'll throw that right over here. 
We'll just let it sit. Okay. All right. So that's done. Very damaged anvil, nether quartz. Nothing is good there. Okay, forget it then. Uh, we'll get the liquid starlight bucket as soon as we can then. And we'll try a bucket on there and see what happens. How much is this producing and how much? Not yet. Can't see how much is in there. We'll just check back on it a little while. We'll have to do something else then for now. That's fine. There's plenty more to do. Should we try throwing this and see if a thing pops out? Will it try to kill me after I try after I throw it? Here we go. Oh, he's so cute! Little cockatrice, come back! No, don't run away from me! Do I have to use the command thing? Get back here! He's so fast, where'd he go? Maybe cockatrice! Come back! Come back to your mother! He wants fish? If I ever find him again... He's gone forever! Alright, I'll try- I'll try getting a fish quick. Oh, I hear him. I think I heard him. I have fish. Alright. I don't know. I'm trusting that's what he wants. Little guy! Little guy, where are you? <gasps> hey! Hey, you! Got something you might want. Sit, boy. Sit. Oh, he's following. Hey, come on. Come on. Come with. Come with. Yeah. Doesn't care about fish. You don't care about nothing. He's beautiful. Um, where do I, where do I, he takes, he takes 1100 seconds to grow. I need to find a nice home for you in the meantime. Um, I should make like a stable for these kind of things. I feel bad about putting Griffin on the roof all the time. What am I gonna do with you? Where can I put you where you're not gonna get killed? He looks like a duck. Um, hmm. I would put you guarding the orchard, but I don't think you're gonna. I mean, it's not very bright in there. Put you guarding the orchard. But won't you get killed by things? I think you'll kill by things. Hmm. Where can I put you that you're gonna not gonna? I'm gonna put you in the basement. I'm gonna put you in the basement. I don't want you to get killed. Come on. Come on. All right. Coming downstairs. You should be safe down here. Come on. All right. You no. Don't want. No. Don't want her. Don't want her. Don't want her. You just sit. You sit right there. That's a good spot for you. We'll come back and we'll be big. You can put pets in your pocket like Pokemon? I can? That's amazing. I'm gonna let him grow. I don't wanna lose him. I have a bad reputation. Thorn will tell you, I got a bad re reputation with pets around here. Stay out of my periphery. If I look at it, will it will it turn me to stone or try to attack me like wither me like uh, the other ones do? That'd be fun. Don't know if they mature though. Mm. We'll let him grow up naturally. It's fine. He can be a free range cockatrice. So wild hunt is done. There's nothing. These are kind of bugged. That's all good. Okay, so we're on the main quest line. Then energy tablets. Uh, I made one of these already. And it says gold with two of these enriched alloys. Rich alloys is steel plus the redstone. And I have a little bit of steel in here. Yeah, let's pour on. Hold on. So I need two of those. And then the rest is take care of. Okay. So we need redstone. I don't know if I need to put more redstone in here or not. Uh, looks like it doesn't need redstone. that. 
And then we can make that other battery and move on with the quest line. Needs more still. I don't want to put too much in there because it'll... Uh... I guess I can click dump and I'll get rid of it. I used it up. Good. Okay. So then we just need redstone and gold. And then we're out of the tier two crafting table pretty soon here. Done and done. Done. Very nice. Now it's sucking energy off of something here. Is it sucking energy off of this? Oh, it is. That's why I, had, that's why I wasn't carrying it around anymore. That's right. Let's just charge it up. I don't know if it needs to be charged up, but we'll just charge it up. Then it'll stop doing that. Ooh, I haven't made more power in a while. Am I still good? Uh, no, I'm not. I'm not good. I'm most far from good. Well, this is not exporting, like once again. As usual. I don't know why it does this to me, but it does this to me. There, now that ex is exporting. And that will continue to power this then. And we're good to go. All right, we got that, we got this, we got that. Now, we're done. Take those steel plates for sure. Oh, we got everything there, nice. That's actually excellent. Uh, put those in there. And that in there. Okay. We are on to Advanced Energy Cube. Stores 3 million RF. Should be upgraded. Well, that's kind of handy. Um, it takes the basic energy cube. I don't think we ever crafted that, did we? I thought we had to. Oh, you know what we had to? We did. We, it was a quest. We didn't actually do it. So now we'll have to take care of that one now. Um, it's fairly cheap. Uh, we need the energy extractor. Two blocks of redstone. No problem. Okay, so let's make one of those energy cubes real quick then. Add that to the to-do list. And then add this advanced one to the to-do list as well. Is it part of the main quest here? It's not part of the main quest. This is the main quest. But it would be good to store more power. That would keep uh, things nice and smooth here. Um, but we don't have to do it right now. We can craft other things first. So we can wait on that. It's on the to-do list. Elite crafting tables are right next. So we got those. I could just claim those, I suppose. We got this. Uh, another block of steel, please. Thank you. So I am at, let's see. Throw those in here, throw that in there. Not that, this. We are at 14 blocks of steel now. That's pretty good. It's pretty, pretty good. All right, so we're at the elite crafting table now. Finally. I need to make two of the advanced crafting tables. Uh, a Prudentium Gear, two of those are rich alloys, and a Core Exchanger, all of which we have made before. So that should be pretty easy to do. And then we're on a Jetpack Components and Easy Blocks, Easy Life. So let's do this thing. Elite Crafting Table. This is a 7x7 seven seven grid. It'll be quite something to behold. All right, so what do we need? Let's start. Let's start doing this thing. Piece by piece. I've never really... I have always struggle when we get to these, these gigantic recipes. And I got to do a bunch of different steps, but uh, we'll be fine here. This one's not that bad. We need two steel. Well, let's start with, let's see with how much steel. Let's take inventory here quick. We need two steel for these, right? We need nothing special there. That's good. We need these guys, iron, and copper, and crafting tables. No big deal there. Uh, mana steel plates. I don't have any of those. So mana steel into plates. And then I need Prudentium gear. Should be too tough to come by. What is a Prudentium? Do we have to make? Oh, do we have to like craft it from a, a another gear? Because that would be stupid. Of course we do. Oh no, it's this copper or something in the middle. That's fine. All these iron. 
That's good. That's good. I'm glad that's the case. Okay. So we got that done. Part one done. All right. That's done. Well, let's put it in my inventory. It doesn't really matter. Uh, next. We need to make man steel plates. Let's do that quick. Craft those up. Next, I need a block of gold. Next, I need iron plates. I have copper plates already on me. Oh my god, here we go. There it is. Copper, iron, and crafting tables. I need some wood. Uh, let's grab out this. Actually, let's not do that. Because I have the wood already made. Let's not waste it like that. Let's not be wasteful. Just because it's wood. There's no need. We need one, two, three, four, five, six for this project. And we need those oak wood for the... Uh, core, right? We need dye and a red or ender pearl, right? Ender pearl is done. And then dye. And the wooden core is obtained. Wooden core. Okay. Next, we need steel. Not boron. Steel and some redstone. Let's see how many of this takes to get going here. One, two, three, four. Five? Five. So five to one. There we go. Now we know. Okay, so that part's done. This part's done. This part's done. That part's done. We just need the... Tables here. Two of those. And bam. We got it. Elite crafting table. Tier 3. Oh boy, that's gonna be tough. Okay, fine. We can deal with it. We can deal with it though. We got that done. We get all those benefits. Easy blocks, easy life factorization. It simply combines and splits various items. For example, ingots into blocks. Okay, nothing's too bad here. I'm seeing steel and bronze. Gotta make that up. I see motors, not too bad. I see advanced control circuits, a couple of steel there, not too bad. Needs 2000 super glue, not too bad there. I need, let's take that off now. I need this redstone servo, which is iron. I need this Tiberium block. Now that might be tough. If I throw Tiberium in here, I get four nuggets. So I need a bunch of that to make up one. But it's not that bad. Can't just grind up those crystals, can I? I like to put the raw crystals in there, though into the smeltery and get it out. So let's just throw in 12. Let's see, it's not one nugget though, right? Here it's two in the alloy. Oh, wait, can I use the kiln? Oh. Um, two Tiberium crystals and Electrotine makes Tiberium ingots. Okay, so that makes two of those. We just need Electrotine to get up then. I have that. So what do I need? I need two. What do I say I needed for this project? I needed a nine, right? 
Okay. So I need to make... If I do 10, we should be fine then. And I need five of these. All right, let's go through, let's go try the alloy kiln. We don't get to use this thing often enough. We, oh, we got that now. How did we do on that? Did we get everything we needed for this? Hey, dial carbide, got it. Claim all that, more steel. Now we're on uranium next, which is made from smelting uranium. We could induct uranium if we use a yellowite and a quartzite sand or sand, we get two. That seems like the way to go. Any kind of sand is the way to go then, I think. Or we can crush it first, probably. Oh, no pulverizer recipe. That's fine. How many, uh, what am I going to name my chicken? You say Carl? I like Carl. Let's see if Carl got big. Oops, a little. How, how a little? 800 seconds. So, like, a little more than 10 minutes. All right. Well, the uh, uranium should be tough to come. It should be easy to come by. I just need sand. I've been gathering it all this time. I don't throw away anything. We need more sand soon. I like the I like the idea of calling it Carl. For the idea that if I accidentally kill it, it can be Carl Jr. next. And that'll be fun. That'd be very fun. I think Carl's the way to go. Coral! Where's my... Oh, there it's out here. Bandit. Carl! Here you go, Carl. You have a name. My son. My beautiful son. Okay. We're getting uranium. Ten of those. We'll have plenty. Um, we need basalt next. That I need to go looking for. I need to go digging for that one. Uh, back to my other quest line here. We are doing the factorization one here. Why is it all these first jetpack components here? If you want to start working on your first jetpack, you need to make various materials. It's especially important you have found ancient dust in a dungeon. One ancient dust, two bacon circuits, copper battery cells. We have just everything we need for this. Do I want a jetpack? I don't want to put I don't want to put Griffin out of work, is the thing. Well, I want the factorizer. We have, we have to do that. Um, do I have pistons? Got one. Need wood casings for those. Which means a lot of wood. All right, so if I take a stack of wood, stack of logs, stack of sticks, I should be able to make a bunch of casings. Bonjour, I don't speak French. Hello, though. Bonjour. So, we're making this guy... Not there. That which was making. Oh, I was going to make the, the these things up. The pistons. I need a bunch of these. I should just make up a ton of those, right?
We'll make a... Let's eat first. Oh, you said hello, how are you? I'm good. I am good. Thank you for asking. Let's drop those in, drop those in, drop those in, drop those in, and drop those in. One more thing. Actually, what I should do here, I should do this differently. Let's go like this. Let's save these things that I have lots of. Grab all these things I have one of. Just save some space in here. There. Okay, we're making sticks, right? I need this guy. I got the artisan men steel handsaw now. Forty-eight. All right, got a stack of those. Just what a stack of these. We're making casings. Fourteen sounds good to me. I don't have to worry about it for a long time. That's the real goal. So we have one piston already. We need a little bit of stone. Some uh, regular stone. And then a alloy ingot and a plate. Steve's cards. I never got into Steve's cards, honestly. I never. It's always. It's always very complicated. It's not super complicated. This isn't that Galgadorian uh, metals or whatever like that. I hate. I hated that stuff. So we got that. We need motor servos. Next. Three of those. Four of these. Made up a stack of that uh, alloy for another quest. Okay, so we got that. Are we in the big crafting yet or not? A little crafting still. Good. So we'll start throwing things in there. We got these. Got these. We need uh, six, seven, eight. Iron. Steel, rather. Plates. Okay. Start making those up. I also need bronze plates, which I already have some of. Oh, I had eight steel plates right here. Well, we'll just replace those. I have bronze plates. Okay. So we're at eight steel plates and eight bronze plates. We'll just replace what we're using up here then. Um, I need cleaning tubes. I have one, of course. Orange dye is acceptable. Let's use orange... Uh, Flowers here. I need six. Oop, I got a crime baby here. I have to go in a second. Ah, oh, where to put my thing here? Here we go. So I need six of these. Go take care of that crying baby. I'll be right back.
I have returned. All right. Where are we out here? Um, motors. That's a little bit of work. These up all my sticks already. I got eight on me. That should be enough. Uh, we're at copper though. Copper is actually kind of tough to come by at the moment. copper. Well, then we're going to have to go mining. A block of copper right here, though, at least. Oh, God. I have a competing uh, screaming going on here. Now I have my uh, my hippogriff and my uh, cockatrice crawling at each other. Hope they get along okay. Oh, that's right. We're doing this. Uh, what's the recipe on this guy? Iron in the middle. Okay, that's done. Um, we're working on making the motors still, right? And for the motors, I need two motors, which takes a lot of copper, actually. And we're not going to have enough. Not gonna have enough. Uh, let's see if there's any copper in here to make. I may have had some off to the side. Uh, iron. Oh boy. There's four. That's enough at least. Oh no, it's not. It's well. I think we have to go mining. Well, ghost boy's new. Cold geo bombs. You know, that's a thing. I don't think so. I think, yeah, the problem is I'm mining too low for copper. I think that's the big problem. I'm going to go someplace new. I'm going to go someplace new and go mining. Let's drop our things off here. Yeah, let's drop some things off here. It's a mob. Oh, yeah. All right, we got a full pack here then. Um, let's try foods okay. Yep, we're okay there. That's at least a whole meal worth. Okay, let's go. Let's go on. Let's go. Uh, take our boy Griffin out for a spin. Let's go. Let's go mine some place new. Where should we go? We've gone across the way there. I probably want to stick to a desert. This is high. I want to be up in the mountains though. Let's go on the other side of the mountain here. And we're not gonna go deep, is the thing. That's the big whole point here, right? Go to this little cave right here. That looks good to me. You don't like me flying through the water like this? Lazarth, out low. Lazarth. Longfall boots still a thing. I'm have I have right now I'm using the uh I'm using the slime boots. Worked, worked okay. We're still not at one hit kills for everything yet. I'm a little disappointed by that. Let's take a look at the best height for copper, though. Copper ore. Copper ore, the best height is like 44. 44, 20 to 44. I'm not actually not that deep then. We're at 47 right now. There we go. Copper right there. Oop. 
Didn't need, didn't need that. There we go. That's a one shot. This one will light up the area a bit and then we'll come back and mine the stuff that I'm seeing. Get out of here, Matt. We need mining music, though. This is too peaceful. Perfect. Just saw my Steam rec streaming recommended and decided to stop by. Well, thank you for dropping in. Appreciate it. This is better mining music. All right, so we're now at 32 for depth. Don't touch those. Oh, what is this? Well, whatever it is, we just killed it. It seems to have spawned in a... Uh... Is someone shooting at me? Well, it seems to have spawned inside of a wall. I love this thing. It's no, it's like so unfair. <laughs> uh, all right, let's let's dig down here. Oh, he was a forest troll. Excuse me. It was a troll. Ooh, got a lollipop over here. Mom around here? There she is. gotten full circle here. I've been over here with torches before. So it must have been over here in a, a long time ago. There we go. Which tree is in the pack? It's not in this pack now. I don't sure. I'm not sure if Witchery's been updated to uh, this model yet, or this version yet, right? Um, it may not have been. Or it just wasn't added. Who knows? All right. Let's go start mining now. I'm looking for iron and copper mostly. I should probably just grab everything though. Tin's getting less useful as the days go on here. Alright. I bypassed a lot of copper, I thought. Coal, I'm gonna need a lot of too, still too. Ah, the, like the, the most basic stuff I still need a lot of. Because I'm digging deeper for stuff. It's a big problem. I can't remember which way I came from. this too. Oh, I'm already out of space. What can I do with this? Troll, force troll leather helmet. Hi there. <laughs> Oh, I came this way. I think, yes, this is where I came in. I 
gonna break these blocks when I see them. They all, all kinds of nasty effects. Came this way. For sake of speed, I might not worry about the whole multiplication thing of the ores or the the, the, the uh, coal here. I'll just grab it because some is better than none. And there's always more to find. It's just you know, it would be obviously better if I could use my pickaxe on it. Oh, we got a big guy over here. Killed him just like that. So this is the way I came with torches, though. This must be where I come in for my uh, bunker when I am under the... Uh... Oh, hi there. Book. When I have a uh, blood moon. This must be where I come. Upgradable dev nulls. Yes, there is that in this mod pack, I'm fairly certain. I haven't gotten enough copper here. I thought we, fought, we passed a lot more on our way in here. I'm at 44 again already, though. We came down here, like, right away. We ran over here. I guess I did grab a lot of it. Here's some. Oh, sorry, little guy. I mean to do that. Excuse me? Am I a juice already? No, I can't be. Excuse me, you're too far away. The problem is this this doesn't have a lot of range on it. It's the only downside of this thing. But I guess it would be over there'd be no reason to use anything else ever if it did have enough range. Still, oh god, hi. Whew. Keep a distance on this guy. Explosive. Finish my stream in two hour two. Too tired? All right. Kid's been waking up a lot with a cough. It's starting to get better, but it's not quite yet. We're too deep again already? We're at 22. We're gonna find a lot of copper this way.
Got him unawares. Oh. Excuse me. So many things. How much did I get for copper? Enough to get started, at least 20 more. So that's 40. That should be enough to get going here. I hope he's satisfied with that much. We'll see what we can find on the way out. Find my way out. Are the torches here? I could slash home, but then my little buddy is gone. I can always come back to him later. He's not too far away. I'm also going around in circles right now. Actually, no, we're not. We're, we're right here. I came in from over here. Came in. Not this way. Not that way either. There's some copper. sure where I came in at this point. No, but actually, we were probably close to the surface. You know, it says the height is at is, is most plentiful at uh, deeper depths, but it seems like it's the most, like, the cur occurrence is fast more, but, like, the veins are smaller. That's what it seems like. Fit the, we fit the surface. Oh, we, I think we saw one of these forest troll over here. No? Oh, we saw something in the distance. Enderman. Hopefully my guy's been left alone here. What is going on over here? Oh, this poor little chameleon is drowning. Ooh. You know what that means? Stay with my horse. Gotta like dig right through here. Ooh, now we're at the jackpot. Look at this. Why is there a staircase going down here? I didn't make this, right? Am I out of room already? All right, might not be the best time to attempt this then. But we know where it is.
Uh, let's take our copper out. Throw it right into there. That'll double it. So we'll have 90. That's great. Throw these things away. I don't get rid of anything, clearly. Results are unpredictable. Magic resistance has been cast on me. That's fun. Are they always unpredictable or are all these going to be magic resistance? Magnet and regeneration. And feather fall. And also resistance and also potion momentum and also purification. all this stuff off in the uh, two sort chest. Just one. Waste punch. Ah, come on. Halloween's almost over. And the re results are unpredictable, so I'm not going to take them if I need something. We'll have one more Halloween stream, maybe. about the stuff I know fits elsewhere. Let's pop this guy open. And this guy. And this guy. Oh, I think I'm hearing the baby again. And he's just coughing. Not much I can do for him. This is full. It is full. Holy cow. Oh, I gotta find something else to do with this stone. Alright, I got one last one second.
right, sorry about that. We're back. Poor baby. Wanted some milk. Had to run out the doors. I've taken to uh, just bring a cooler and ice pack upstairs. Throw the milk inside the cooler, then I'll have to run back up, up and downstairs. Well, should I try to sort something out with this, or should I just make the storage higher? Let's just make the storage higher. Since I already have an upgrade, might as well just do it. If I can find where I put that now. This stuff. No? Oh, it's this, um... Oh, that's the wrong type. That's the problem. Never mind. It's probably not even full yet, then. It'll get full eventually. All right. So that takes care of the copper situation, at least. I should have left this on pause so I could get this thing processed while I'm sitting here. But we got some already. 64. Sounds good to me. 10 more to go still. But we have enough for our things. And we're doing like this, like this. And some sticks. I left them over here. I left them over here. Two of those. Sticks. Copper, why not? Alright. So one. Two of those. Okay. So then we're working on making these motors. Needs. Oh, well, that works too. I guess I'm getting the idea of it. That's fine. Let's see. I need some type of stone brick, I think. Does it need to be stone brick? But it needs to be something that vain. Oh, and gold. Feed Carl seeds. He can't have kids? Oh, man. Carl. Poor Carl. Oh, let's, I, bet he's, I bet he's grown by now. Well, really? 241 still. All right. Gold gear. Two of those. And... Oh, it's not brick. It just looks like brick because it it's that chisel. It's cobblestone, I bet. Any kind of cobblestone should work then. No? Chisel? Regular stone? Okay. That was a mistake on two counts then. Shale will work. Alright. How much for copper seeds? I think we need tier 3 for almost all the ores. Any kind of ore we need tier 3 for, I want to say. Um, Glowstone. Oh no, we need tier 2. That's not that bad. Tier 2 crafting seeds plus essences. Let me make a couple of those right away. Uh, That should just about do it. That'll save me some trouble. Not a whole lot, but... Works for me. really making a coal, coal one up here. And I gotta automate this. I've looked into automation for this. And we gotta get, like, the, the harvester or something. 
And that's that's like a tier four thing. Because it needs the plastic, which is actually a high level thing, apparently. Oh, that's all in here now, isn't it? Once I get enough of these extra inferium seeds, I will uh, replant those. So you have 37 coal essence now. I think this goes like this. Each of those makes six. So that's 24 right there. It's all for free now. That's great. And then we're getting, what, like 20, 30, 40 something off of that for the uh, essences? So that's pretty decent. Okay, so that's done. Claim that. And then we just need to collect copper essences for the next part here. But we'll get there for that. Not too bad a deal. We we get uh, a little bit of Prudentium back. You should upgrade seeds when you can. I, I do. I do. I, I guess I should do. I have to make over this Prudentium. And my thing here is almost broken. I just, have, I just haven't been. I've been lazy about making one another new one of these. It shouldn't be too tough to do. We have mana, diamond, essence, ingots, and all that. So it's not that expensive. But I'll make a new one of those soon. Then we'll have all the stuff we need. Uh, moving on to this, though. The factor factorization guy. Uh, I did this, right? We got our... Oh, we didn't do that one. Where was I putting that? What was my plan for this? Oh, it was to throw Tiberium right into the thing. It's four nuggets for each. Yeah, let's make a block out of that. Uh, how many nuggets do you think are in a block? Or how many, how many, yeah, how many nuggets are in a block? It's nine times nine, so 81. But this is a, this is four nuggets for each. So 81. Well, let's do this. It's gonna be a lot though. Oh, one block. I just did it. I just did it without even thinking about it. Okay, cool. Um, boom. I love when a plan works out. When there's no plan at all. Beautiful. And this is useful stuff. It's used for all kinds of things. For a demon pylon? Ender hopper. All kinds of stuff in here. Oh, we made one of these already. The soul stone. Alright, so we have this part of it. That part's done. Now what? We got the, those done. This is done. This is done. Like you should be able to knock out the tuck to tier one seeds and some of the tier two resources with the random seeds. I mean that that should be it's not a bad idea. We could probably knock those out pretty quickly. Um Yeah, we'll do that after this. Uh I need this advanced control circuit, that's what we need. And so we need gold, circuit boards, two circuit boards, one steel. Uh, we need these circuit plates. And a bit more gold. Oh, I need two steel. I have to break my first block of steel pretty soon here. Because then we just need, uh, Super glue in there. I have some of that set aside for a rainy day. And how much does this need? Two buckets. And advanced control circuit. Okay. So that takes care of that. What else are we missing here still? Nothing. Nothing at all. There we go. Factorizer. Combines and splits various items. So that's actually huge because I can make blocks and stuff very, very easily now with that. Oops, not there. Does this need power? Oh, it doesn't need power. Well, that's handy. Look, 
put over here? If it doesn't need power, I'll just put it next to this machine here. I don't want to do any inputs on it, though. Because I don't want to pull in a prudential ingots like that. But if I need to make a bunch, bunch of blocks, I could pipe stuff into it, which is nice. Combines or splits items into smaller or larger. So if I need to make blocks out of my silver here, just combines it together. No power needed. Just makes them all. That's fantastic. Saves on space. Saves on work. Because normally I have to tear these things into plates to make them. It's a small thing. But it's very helpful. I can use this for all kinds of stuff. Alright, so that takes care of that then. Factorizer is done. Easy blocks, easy life. Get a couple more steel plates and a motor. That is actually kind of a decent reward for doing all that. Alright. Moving on. Next, we're up to the basic bins. A basic bin is a block that can stock a significant quantity of a single item, up to 4,096. The items can be put together manually or automatically by a logistic transporter. This block has two attachment points for logistical transporters up and down to work. It doesn't require any type of power, and it shows the quantity of the item on the front, which is very useful. Okay, so bins are kind of cool from mechanism. Now, oh, what's it cost to make a bin? It's not that bad. These are kind of tough to make, but actually that's really fairly cheap for a barrel. And this, and this thing. So it's, um... Yeah, it's just like a different kind of... It's just basically a barrel, right? We get base, three basic bins as a reward there. You had advanced things already? What do you mean? Ooh, diamond hook. Oh, I forgot about that, that thing here. Alchemical imbuer. Advanced backpack, solar panels tier three, choose your path, battery box, grid power. There's lots coming off of this one. A lot depending on that one. Well, I think for the sake of progression here, I should do that, the basic bin. Um, fairly cheap, actually. I mean, really long, long, long term. It's not that bad. I do need to get a, another, um, Control circuit, though. In the gold chest, there's three of them. But you made one? What? Gold chest, I made three of what? The motors? No. Oh, these things. Oh, geez. Yeah, you're right. That's all right. We'll need those for all kinds of stuff. I got those as a reward for something I forgot about. But yes, you're right. I, I should have just used those. Well, you know, we'll uh, we'll need them still. It's fine. We have plenty of steel too, and it's like like I said, these things are used for all kinds of different crafting. Who advanced bands right away too? A flamethrower? Well, hello there. Nice to meet you. Thermal evaporation. Oh, I don't know what that's about. This is some high-tech stuff here. Okay. Ooh, wait, is that what the mining drill is? Hold on. Diamond drill. Steel drill. Needs a battery. Hello. Mm. Okay, no, I, don't get distracted. Focus, focus, focus on the task at hand. What basic bins we should do? Okay, we got to make one of those these things then. Flame floor is too risky. <laughs> I think you're right. That is a definite problem for me. So if we go with, uh, if we go with. Man of Steel, which isn't too tough to come by. I can make two of these for the price of one. I can make 40 over here if I do Crystalline. Ooh, Crystalline's not impossible. It takes a little more crafting than everything else does, but making 40 of these right now would be amazing. I need 5,000 blue. That's not bad. I think I should just do this. Crystalline ingots. 
Oh wait, I need to do a lot to make those. Never mind. Crystalline, crystalline, not crystalline. Crystalline teen is something different. Crystalline. That's way, way different. Okay. So let's let's take a look at the seeds. I have tier one crafting seeds. I have essence. I have essence. I have everything I need. Okay, let's go into the seeds one here. Magical agriculture, and we need nature, ice, and zombie. Oh, zombie might be tough to come by. Actually, no, I, I did that. I got that already. I got the uh, zombie chunks right here. Four of those. Zombie chunks. Boom. Zombie seeds. I don't know what we can do with zombie seeds, but we can make them. Um, zombie seeds are done. Okay, so uh, now... What do they want me to do next with that? Zombie seed, zombie essence. That's why I make rotten flesh, which actually is the short path to having unlimited leather. Not that I, you know, need that, but it's good to have, I guess. Ice seeds. I need ice blocks. That I don't have. Oof. Ice seeds, ice blocks. Bucket of water with cryothium. Yes. To make four. I don't have that much cryothium, though. Heat to frame cooling. No. Centrifuge. No, no, no. Centrifugal separator. No. Glacial precipitator. No. Factorization. Uh, Snow with an alchemical catalyst. That one is not too far away aside from the brewing stand being a thing. Actually, I should make another brewing stand to do that. Alchemical, yeah, the alchemical catalyst is actually very, very helpful for all kinds of stuff. I have one brewing stand here already, so we'll use that. Um, let's do that. This will actually... Uh, why is it catalyst? Alchemy catalyst, that's the one. Okay, we need to make uh, gold... Another brewing stand. That's the big problem here. Two blaze rods, wood tank, mana steel plate. I have all that. Wood tank. Is it done? Mana steel plates might be done. Nope. But this will actually give us options for all kinds of stuff. Carly's rotten flesh. That's disgusting. Carl, what are you thinking? Oh, Carl might be grown now. He might be a real boy. I heard barking. Is Carl barking at me? Hey, Carl. Oh my god, he's beautiful. Come here, Carl. What if I drop this on the ground for you? You like that? No? You don't want this? Is there a cockatrice armor? Cockatrice skull. Cockatrice eye. Cockatrice scepter. Wither targets. Wither's targets when used can apply multi, can target multiple close entities. That's fun. What can I can do with this guy? It doesn't seem like anything. Okay, well, you just stay here. I'll put him out on patrol, though. I mean, I trust him out there. Curl does not want to eat anything, though. Okay, so moving on. We are making the alchemical catalyst. It makes bronze plates. And some blaze rods. And then a lot of stone. Chiseled stone. Any kind of stone. Not terracotta. Shale. All right, that'll work. Uh, let's eat something here quick. So my hunger's fading again. We got one thing left in there. I got 23 seconds of speed. 
Uh, we're going over here, right? So it's these. Tank. Some of these. Some of these. And the mana steel plate. And I should just make two of these right away. Because they're not that expensive. And then I have one to make brewing. If I want to do some brewing. There's one. And more, more tank, which I already have. I had the foresight to just make a bunch of tanks. Okay, and then we need one mana pearl. Oh, I have some. The other Tiki Village? Oh, that may be fun. Yeah, I don't exactly remember where it is either, though. I need gold. And I need... Rock. And then what we can do... Is we take this guy... And we throw him underneath this guy... take dirt, we take snow, and change it into ice. And hopefully it doesn't take too much mana. Uh, where did I put that? It's over here. Turn four snow into four ice, then we can make all the ice we need. We'll never have to worry about it again. We'll make the seeds for it. Beautiful. And then, get our job back out. It's just like that. Same as other stuff. Seeds, done. Zombie seeds, ice seeds. Claim another ice seed, sure, why not? Claim another zombie seed, sure, why not? And then we're on nature seeds. Nature seeds lets us make any kind of seed we want. We need nature. Oh, that's the one that was thing that was holding me back, right? Nature cluster. Um, nature clusters are pumpkins, cactus, sugar canes, and wheat. Pumpkin and cactus are the tough things right now. Cactus, I planted a few more of those over here. So the big problem is just getting these things without breaking them. So if they hit themselves, they will break and we'll lose them. Okay, so I have six there and I have enough pumpkins here. I planned ahead for this part. All right, so now we got nature essence on the way. What did I say? Uh, it was wheat and something else. Sugar cane? Sugar cane. So nature's essence was sugar cane, wheat, cactus, and pumpkin. Four of these. And then we put those together with this, same as everything else. And nature seeds are on the menu. Very nice. Okay. So nature seeds are done. And now we just got to get all the essences. Okay. So let's go over here. Let's, um, let's drop some things off back in here. We'll plant these in the ground. Uh, I want to upgrade... The seeds I have. Let's do as much of this as we can. This thing might be out of juice now. 28 uses left. Oh, it's got juice still.
12 uses left. There we go. All right, that broke. But not before we got a ton of stuff we need. Okay, so then we take these Inferium Seeds Tier 1. We surround them like this. Then we come Tier 2. We'll put those back in the ground. Because then we're using more space up more efficiently. And we have Tier 3 also now. I don't think I have any room for Tier 3, though. Actually, I could do one more. And it's probably not worth it. I want to save this in Intermedium. So let's put these out. I hear a spider. Oh, I don't want to hit my guy. Why are you eating a spider, dude? There, jeez. They're, they're snuggling up there. Don't know what that's about. Oops, didn't mean to do that. I just didn't want to accidentally waste um, your ability on my sword by swinging around like that. Out of space. I was meant I meant to drop off some things so I could had space for all this. Totally meant to do that. Alright. Done, done, done. Space, space, space. There we go. Space. 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 All right. Now we can mess around better. You're better. Oop, it's almost night, though. I love how fast these things grow. I gotta sleep quick here. Ooh, how's this doing? Ooh, pretty full. Doing pretty well here. All right. So we need like eight of these to complete the quest. Once we're done with some of the food quests, I can, I can reclaim some of the space and uh, just use it for Mystical agriculture over here. Instead of having like, the wheat and the canola oil milt in here. These things grow so fast. Love it. Okay. Um, if I just spend some time over here all day, I could just get this thing done. Like, look how fast that goes. Okay. So we need to change some of our tier 2 stuff out for tier 3. We're looking at tier 2 right here. Put that in. And then we need to change some of our tier 1 stuff out for tier 2. Tier 2, tier 2, tier 2. Tier two, 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 Why did I end up with only one copper seed? And we have more tier two seeds. We want to take out more of our tier ones. Okay. Cool. So, oh no, I got the copper here. Never mind. Like I said, if I just hang out here long enough, I'll get all this stuff done. I also have this, which grows stuff instantly. Oh, it doesn't doesn't work that fast, I guess. I thought I was going to grow it all in one click. If I just got to use, like, bone meal, who cares? I'm going to wait 10 seconds, it'll grow. So that knocks that out. All these are ready to go, then. I need 8 for this.
I'm not ready to retire the potatoes and cotton just yet. Canola I shouldn't retire at all because I do need that for power. But I could migrate it over here once these things are done, while the food quests are done. That is six. Ooh, our first icicles. How many do I need for the uh, icicle one? I need 10 for the icicle one. Right, let's go drop stuff off. Let's throw the corn in here. We can go back. Potatoes can... I have so many potatoes. I should probably just give it up. Salt. Deal with that later. Oh, throw these in here too. Alright. So with the uh, mystical stuff here, we can make any flower we need. That makes electrotine, which is great. So I've gotten so much of that now. Those are great. This is good. Those can be upgraded. These can go in here. That's so good. Okay. Yeah, this mystical agriculture stuff is super helpful. All right, we're working essences then. Um, I should just grab some bone meal. Get to this, get, get this done. So we need 10 of the ice. Takes longer to make these grow. Oh, I guess yeah, I guess I'm guessing bone meal doesn't work on mystical stuff. That's fortunate the um that the, the, the uh, uh sprinklers do though. That should be eight. That'll take care of the one quest. Um, let's go grab some of this mystical bone meal instead. You put up the calipers. I'll throw these in the, the bin. I should probably take it downstairs so it's not taking more space. I throw one here. Oop, we got uh more meals on the way. How we do here? That's good, that's good, that's good. No, no, and no. So, hit or miss. Are those, these, and this. Okay. So that part's done. And then we just need to have copper for six. And six copper will do it. Any copper will do it. Claim that. That part's done. Uh, what else are we doing here? We got the rubber essence. Well, that will be helpful, actually. Getting rubber seeds done. The tier two crafting. Uh, we need to take some of our tier one crafting seeds and make them tier two, though. This guy, nature seeds. So just the prudentium, huh? Oop, which means I need to make another one of those crystals. Ah, it's always something. Okay. Bone meal that works on a resource crops. What's the recipe for this? It's just looted. Oh man, that sucks. Do some more. Requesting around the base all day? Yeah, that's a good idea. Probably get out of here. Stretch the old legs.
Got enough power coming off of this. That's good. Again, this is not flowing out of there properly, but that's fine. All right. So, where should we head? The world is large now. I don't want to head all the way back down over the ice, even though that makes a lot of sense. Heading to this snowy area here would make a lot of sense, because we can make a mine down there and look for a, a dragon, ice dragon. This is Southern Alps over here. I wish there was closer Southern Alps. Well, I could go south. I mean, I just, I just I, now that I've seen how far south we have to go, I could keep going further south. I mean, we went really far south here. If I go as far south as this, I'm sure I can get there, and that'll be better, better for flying. So let's just go straight south from our house. There's a whole bunch of area not explored here. King Ants, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Uh, let's drop off some things before we go then. I'm just going to go straight south. Explore that. Uh, let's make sure we have enough food. Eh, I think we do. And this is empty. Yep, let's make sure this is charged up though before we go. How hard is this game? Uh, this mod pack? It's pretty hard. I would say. I mean, your mileage may vary, but... The enemies are brutal. The rest crafting recipes are very difficult. It's, uh, you really kind of have to want to play Minecraft. I think at the end of the day, that's, that's the big difference. You're going to have to want to do a lot of complicated, like crafting. I'm excited for when I finally get done with this mod pack and move on to something where like everything's much easier, like move on to like any other mod pack where things are just like normal. It'll be so exciting. I'll get so much done. Naplex, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Minecraft is life. That's, yeah, that's, I mean, this is going to get you the most Minecraft. Let's go. Let's go sleep here first before we head off. I mean, the, the, the nice thing about this mod pack, I will say, it's, it's difficult, but every single step you take feels super rewarding. Like, it's not like... Sometimes in mod packs, you'll just get overpowered. And uh, this one extends the the mid game quite a bit, which I like. You don't get overpowered at all. I mean, every single upgrade, it's like, oh man, I can finally like not die now. This is fantastic. And I really like that. Every single upgrade is significant then. No matter how small you feel like you accomplished something when you craft something. And it, it feels nice like to, to not like get overpowered immediately. And like even the mobs, like the mobs are the mobs are now the normal mobs are pretty much non-essential now. Um, with my new weapons here, some of the the more advanced mobs might still be a problem, but they're rare, rare. So it's getting to the point where I'm a little overpowered. Look at this. Have we been here before? We're not just we're not we're not the new area already. Did I go the wrong way? I did go the wrong way. This is not south, guys. Dying at the start was super hard. Yeah, dying at the start was definitely hard. It's hard to get going. Once you get established, every single upgrade after that feels so nice. You're accomplishing something all the time. We've been over to that house before. Are we back to going south now? I am going southward. I want to get more south, like directly south of the house. So I'm going to head back to the east a little bit further, or the west a little further here. I think we are to a region we've been to before. Are we not quite south of the house? 
just want to end up going like straight south. Hippogriff. We're gonna do some dog fighting up here. Are we there yet? Nope, it's still further over. It's way further over still. Let's keep going. I guess I'll see the little dot change positions as we get further west. I guess we went really far east. Oh, we're getting there. 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 Okay, we're south. Here we go. I definitely recommend checking it out. Like, the, the crafting recipes, once you wrap your head around how complicated everything gets, it's not too bad. And being willing to work outside of the quest book helps a lot, too. If you can make stuff before you need to, certain things, it can really help progress faster. That's the only thing I would say is is necessities. Ooh, this is nice to be right south of us. Have we opened this one up already? No, that's new. We're in new territory already. Um, there's a meteor over there. I'm gonna mark this dungeon here quick. I always need a new look, roll like dungeon to explore here. I'll come out here maybe off camera. I won't get too deep. Like the first floor should be actually this might not be a problem anymore. Maybe next step is maybe next stream we'll do one of these dungeons. A uh, new dungeon. We'll do this dungeon next time. I won't touch it all. New dungeon for stream. All right, we'll do this one next time. We'll explore that one. Have you heard of a mod pack named Slime Fun? I have not heard of that one. I like I like the idea I like I like the the idea though. Slime based mod pack? I'd be all for that. What I'd like is a mod pack. If you guys ever play the mobile game uh Egg Inc. It's a it's a clicker. But like as you progress through, you basically upgrade your hatcheries and upgrade your chicken farm and you produce different kinds of eggs. And then you get like eggs that are made from super material and eggs that can cure cancer and eggs that can travel through time. And I would love a mod pack based on, or just a, not a mod pack, just a mod based on egg ink and all the different things you could do with eggs in that. And the different kinds of chickens you would have to breed to get those eggs. I think that would be fantastic. And there might be something like that already, but I would love to play something like that. That would be... Ooh, look, a red dragon. Hello, dragon. Uh, I don't want any trouble. I know you see me. I see you. Let's just, let's just go each, let's go our separate ways here, bud. All right. All right. All right. Let's agree to disagree. We're finding a whole lot of boring landscape. I'd love to find another town or something. We found some enemies. A little house. Ooh. Oh no! Oh no! You jerks! No! You jerks! Ugh, get out of here! Griffin, get out of it! Get out of it! Oh my god. One of those those webbing guys. Tough. Bone golem withered away. Jeez. It's not to get too far off the southern path here, but there's the amount of what chickens makes them all give you different materials like golden eyes. So that wouldn't be bad. Like that would be like that. But I would want like things that go even more extreme with it. Make chickens give you like I don't know higher level stuff. Like different things you can actually make with chicken stuff. It would be kind of like mystical agriculturally when it boils down to it. But I'd want it to have like some type of tech progression. 
and like machines you have to make with for the different chickens, like quantum egg, like quantum hatchery, that kind of thing. That's what I would like to have. And so you have like, you're, it'd be like a clicker in Minecraft. You'd have like, you'd start with raising regular chickens instead of Minecraft, but eventually you'd have to have so many chickens to craft some things that you need to build like quantum machines to house the chickens. And then you have to like, they'd be like breeding like, you know, 20,000 eggs per second or something like that. And you have to use all those eggs to make something else. Uh, that's what I want. That's what I'd like. Basically, it just takes egg ink and makes it into a, a Minecraft clicker kind of thing. That would be interesting. To me, anyways. For like 10 minutes, then I'll get bored with it. Move on, probably. It could be cool, though. Who knows? I think that's how it would start. Like, the mod would have to start with you getting, like, gold and silver and eggs, or, uh, from the front and iron from the eggs. But then progress into like getting redstone and diamonds from eggs and then progress into like getting more advanced alloys and stuff like that from eggs you create that's how i see it happening so we've hit something here this is just oh it is alps <gasps> it is extreme southern alps we found alps we found alps you guys i knew we'd find it oh look a village <gasps> a village with walls What? Hold on. Oh, look at this. All of the markers came back. Why did it do that? Oh, I think I'm hitting Z or something like that. I bet you Z is what's doing it. Yep, it's Z. Z is what's doing it. Except if I hit Z again. Uh, let's see. Four. Three. Z. Three. Z, one, Z, two, Z, one. Okay, now we got it. If I hit Z, which brings up that alt, I've got to, I got to remap my controls what happens to happen then. This is cool. Now, is this going to be a dangerous thing? Hello there. Hello. Oh, hi. Ah! It's abandoned camp. They're still coming in. Oh my God. There's spawners up here someplace. Grapple up to the bandit camp. Tool bag. What is that for? Oh, I killed one of the, oh, I killed one of those guys. The highwayman was slain. They didn't anticipate a laser man here. Uh, I don't need that, don't need that, don't need that. El looks for regeneration, I might just take that right now. I got a Waddle Dee, I don't need a Weather Waddle Dee. Why do these guys have Waddle Dee? I don't know. What is this about? Oh, it just gives us random tools. Sandstone axe. Don't have to don't need that. So this is just gonna be garbage in here, basically. This is what you're telling me. This is all just gonna be a complete waste of time. You know what? It will, we'll have made the world a little safer though if we take out this bandit camp. I think. We need something more. Uh... There we go. That's better. dangerous <laughs> oh hello there he's watching us from the towers Ooh, there's a lot in this room oh We 
We're getting a lot of bandit name tags. And a lot of nothing here. Holy cow. What is this garbage? It hops. They're brewing their own beers. You idiot. All right. Look at your friends here. Hi there. A lot of garbage. Holy cow. This is the most worthless place on the planet. So now it's going to be nighttime. We got a diamond and a platinum plate out of it. That's not bad. And a chocolate cake. Hey, that's not that's worth that's worth it. Worth, worth visiting. Alright. I'm satisfied with our trip then. We've done something. And we saved this chicken. They were holding captive. Uh let's get a sleep bag out quick. Hopefully nothing happens. I think it's safe now. How could they have better houses than villagers? I don't know. I think they probably just killed the, a nice village and took it over. And they don't go after the normal villages because they're crappy. That's my that's my headcanon for this. I think we're okay with going with something simpler now. Back to adventure music. All right. Just sorting through things. I got lots of name tags at least out of it. That's one thing that's kind of nice. I'll sap. Like, I'm not going to throw that away, but not super excited about it. I'm going to throw all these things away, though. I have too much leather armor already. I'm not dealing with it. Okay. Let's get back to our buddy. Griffin, where are you? Well, I have captive horses here, too. We can't save everybody. Oh, this village right here is under attack. Hey, guys, we took care of your bandit problem. Hope you don't mind. You can thank me by letting me steal all your things. Oh, I, I wasn't stealing anything, sir. A sage, huh? Oh, that's kind of handy. Gunpowder for emeralds and uh, other work for emeralds, especially. Can I take you home with me? That'd be nice. Ooh, that's kind of nice, too. Uh, let's get this out. Did I throw something here I shouldn't have? I guess not. More storage for sure. And a blueprint for an arc furnace electrode. Nice. All right. And this is a blacksmith here. What are you doing? Here? What happened here, bud? This dude got hit by a meteor, right? It's just like, no big deal. I don't care. You got, you got hit by a meteor, right? No, sir. I don't think that's true. Yeah, it is. Sir. Do you need assistance? No, I'm good. You sure? I'll let you out. Nah. I want to be in a meteorite. Alright. There's so many sages in this town. Is that the same sage? No, I don't think it is. There's a sage here. Sage here. Town of sages. Oh, like, seriously. Red mechanic, sages. Sage. Everyone's a sage these days. The local sage college is nearby. Dude, what's up with this old sages? A druid has fish and apple. Another sage! You guys! You know there's other jobs, right? 
All right, I'm just gonna name this one though, Sage Town. Sage Town. If I ever need a sage. Actually, if I never need emeralds, I'm coming here. Because these guys have really nice trades. Look at this, a green dragon. Oh, look at that nest. How cool is that? Look at this guy's nest. A green dragon on top of a mountain like that. How cool is that? He has some scorched uh, stuff down here. This guy's, these guys have been rough. They got bandits over there. They got a dragon over there. This ta sage town is situated in the middle here. I don't know what, uh, I don't know, I don't know what. I don't know what to make of that. We wanna go kill this dragon. What do we gotta do? Let's go over here and park. Yeah, no ice dragon though. Although, maybe it's an ice dragon, it just doesn't look like an ice dragon. Maybe it's a fire dragon. Maybe it's not a fire dragon. Let's go kill it and find out. Let's make sure I have enough battery for this. I think we got enough. We are a little bit exposed here though. I mean, if he spits up ice instead of fire, we'll know. I mean, maybe the ice dragons don't look any different. I mean, I was anticipated blue for an ice dragon, but... I don't want to get too close here, but I do want to kill him. Give him the tail. I don't want to teach him. If I get on the other side of this mountain, I might be able to hit him through it. Last time we got this close, though, is a big problem. They are lighter. Where'd he go? He's working his way down the hill. Oh my god, he's trying to get away. Oh, he's fast. Okay, we might be in trouble now. Get some distance, just in case he comes up over the hill. And don't jump in the lava. Whatever you do. He went off this way. There he is. He's a fire dragon. Dude, you keep hanging out over there like you're not gonna get killed. You're in the trees, it's actually my natural element here, you realize. You will die much easier for me in the trees, sir. An angry one. Sorry, buddy. Sorry about all that. But now we get to our victory music. There we go. We got another dragon. Woohoo! Kind of died awkwardly. 
hanging out of a tree. But a victory is a victory nonetheless. Okay, should we get blood or should we get scales? Or a little bit of both? Do I have bottles? I do not. So, scales it is. Level three dragon. Taken care of. Oh, hi there. Very cool. So we got more green dragon scales. Green dragon scales were used for other things than the red ones, I believe. Uh, we can make green dragon scale armor, which increased protection for dragon breath attacks. Uh, the emerald level here is better, I think, than the other stuff. I'm not sure. We might have enough now, though, for that. That'd be fantastic. Not that I ever get attacked by a dragon, but maybe when we get underground, we will. So it might be good to have. And now we gotta get up to the top here. And we can steal this guy's stuff. Climb the mountain. Steal the dragon's loot. Steal the dragon's loot. But killing a dragon is nothing now. Yeah, it's like we don't even need like full gear. We don't need to like, plan ahead. We just like just get it done now. That's what I mean. This is progression. And we need our trusty Dennis out here. We'll come around getting the chest afterwards. Oh, we need this already activated. And we can take these guys and set them down in the middle here. Get even more loot. This is our nest now, so we can sleep here too. Got a nest and a dragon nest. It's a beautiful thing. All right, that's enough of that. All right, let's, uh, oh, this is full. Another one of these, that's fantastic. Okay, so now let's throw this in here. And if that'll fit, oh, it all fits. Okay, so now I'll go around and just break these guys. And everything will flow right into the uh, backpack. fits. Hopefully. We're getting a lot of good stuff here, I can already tell. We'll see what our spoils are later. Nice. Oh, there's more still. Holy cow. No room for that mana steel ingot. Wow. Okay. Is that it? Oh, one more. Uh, we need to get more, more room still. I'm sure some of that stuff doubled up so I can get the stuff now. Is home still on top of the building? I believe it is. So we can jump right back there. So we got spoils upon spoils upon spoils. We got some steel. 
some diamonds going on. We can consolidate a little bit here. Oh, baby's up again. Well, we might have to head home and wrap up the stream pretty soon here. The baby's going to be like this about it. Lots of good stuff here, though. Lots of good stuff. Okay, let's uh, grab these guys here. Oop, it's going storage into storage, though. I should probably avoid that. So let's leave some space in here, then we'll turn this off. And then we'll go check on the baby here quick. I'll be right back. One more gold atop uh, top of here. I didn't see that. Uh, get rid of the tools. Probably could get rid of the tools. Yeah, so the baby's up again, of course. It's been like that all night for the last, like, four days or so. So with that in mind, I should probably get some sleep. Um, let's find Griffin. It's, he's up again already. He is, didn't last long. It doesn't seem like I could do anything for him. So, let's get him. Let's head home. And we'll probably have to wrap the stream for now. But I'll sort through things between episodes here. Next time we'll come back, we'll do that roguelike dungeon. And uh, also come back over here and look around underground here. So I'm guessing there's going to be an ice dragon. It's going to be an ice biome. I don't know if this will actually count. We might have to find like a proper ice biome. I don't know, but we'll see. Uh, might not just be cold. It might not be enough. Is there any gold underneath here? Sometimes it spawns underneath. No, it doesn't seem like it. Doesn't seem like it. Yeah, but I think you like get inside one of these mountains and just look around. Because like, it'll be a big cavern, right? That'll have a, a dragon, underground dragon in it. 
mean, that can't be just like anywhere. We have to have like a mountain, I think. I mean, dragons inside of mountains, it's a thing, right? There's one temple in my chest. Oh, uh. Oh, our slash home didn't work. Oh, we, I guess, I guess our guy is going to clip into the ground, probably. And so we need to like walk back the old fashioned way. Uh, this guy does this, does have a chest here. Let's see if there's anything good. Uh, oh yeah, there is. Well, I don't need these anymore. I'll take that, this, and this. Um, let's get rid of those. Get rid of this. I don't need that. Mana steel's good. Silicon plates are fine. A twitchy, a twitch plushie. Sure, why not? Cheeseburger treasure map. Well, we'll have to put that. We'll have to keep track of where we're at here for that. We have to head back, come back here to find that one, but that's okay. Everything else. Eh, a nori plate, not a big deal. Um, let's take the cheeseburger, I guess. All right. Well, the baby's crying again already. I should probably just wrap up the stream right here. Griffin has room. You're right. Oh, I should leave anything behind. Griffin, take my things. No, I want to use the open hand, I think. Nope, got a shift click. Shift click, there we go. Oh, he doesn't have much room though. Because I forgot to clean him up from before. Well, that's fine. We got, we got, that's fine. I don't think I'm leaving anything crucial back over here. Maybe the inner plate. That's about it. All right. Well, with that said, let's head, let's wrap up the stream here. Thank you guys so much for watching, Thorn. Uh, anybody else lurking out there still? Uh, King Gantz and, and, uh, Palatado. Thank you guys so much for joining me tonight. Anybody else lurking out there? Thank you guys so much for joining me tonight. I'll be back on Wednesday for the next stream. If it's going to be Minecraft, it'll be back on Twitch. If it's something else, I might do... I mean, if it's uh, Minecraft, I'll do it back on YouTube here. If it's something else, I'll do... Might be on Twitch. We'll see what happens. So, if you are interested in watching more of these streams, make sure to go and follow me on Twitch as well. Because um, you never know where it's going to end up sometimes. But as long as you guys are viewing it on YouTube, I might just keep doing these YouTube ones. So, anyways, thanks so much for watching. And I'll see you next time for more. Thank you.